Hello everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel to another video. I know you might be thinking, what's happening right now? Well, I want to try a load of dresses. Let me tell you about it. So I, Paul wants to take me to a kind of posh, it's not like super posh restaurant. So it made me want to buy a dress. I will tell you more about that event in my next video that you're going to see. But today is um, dress try on. Now, I actually went on to the Simply Be um, website to see if I could find anything that I liked. I couldn't. So I went on to Next and ordered a load of stuff. I also ordered some cardigans to try on because at the moment it's still a little bit chilly. Now, the main thing I want from the, this dress is for it to be new. Um, as you know, I mainly wear dresses, if not 100% of the time. Um, and the ones I've been wearing them a long time, washing over and over again, and they just haven't got that, you know, that freshness of being a new dress, if that makes sense. I'm talking with my hands lots. You guys know what I'm like. Anyway. Let's just crack on. I'm going to open the bags and show you what's Okay, inside. guys, dress number one. I have no idea. So here's the price. £38. So it's not the cheapest dress. Let's put it on. Okay, so here's dress number one. When I look in the mirror, I like it, but... Is it too frumpy? Too much of a like moo moo kind of thing. I'll be wearing the dress with sandals, flat sandals, because I don't wear heels. Um, so I want it to be casual. I also want the dress to be something that I can wear on a day to day basis afterwards. I'm not keeping this dress for best because there is no best. Um, so what do you think? I do quite like it. It's very comfy, very flowy, but I don't know if it does my figure any justice and if it just looks really frumpy. I for sure am going to need your thoughts, your kind thoughts, should I say, in the, in the comments. Let me know which one is your favourite, okay? So dress number one. Dress number two, you guys. I forgot to show you up close, but um, I'll put on the screen how much it is because I put it on before looking. What do you think? It's a lot thinner. I can easily put a slip under it. It is slightly off the shoulder. Um, I don't like this bit here. Let me see. Either I tuck it in a bit. No, don't like that. Hmm. I don't know. Lengthwise, I've gone for all sort of just below the knee kind of thing. Uh, what do you think, you guys? Dress number three, you guys. So this is probably the longest. It's more of a maxi dress. If you can see, is it too much of a moo moo? Again, too frumpy. I tell you what I do like about this dress. I like the neckline. I like the sleeves. It feels super comfortable. I think this is the most expensive dress, which is £40. But tell me what you think. Is it too much? I think it's too much. I think it's too, too busy. I don't know. It feels a bit bit too frumpy I don't know maybe I am frumpy but what do you think mm -mm. again I do really like the sleeve it hides the worst part of my arm it's really flowy so it doesn't stick to you in any way um it's nice and long so no worries about showing anything you don't want to but at the same time sorry I'm not sure if it's, um, I think it's, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, guys, this is dress number four. I don't like it. 
um, first of all, I will definitely ha would have to wear a slip underneath. It's that kind of sort of beach overall kind of thing. Um, I feel it would cling on to the wrong areas like my tummy. I don't know. Yeah, it's a bit, it's too basic. Um, it is very comfortable. It almost would be something I would wear to sleep in, you know. Um, what do you guys think? This is £20. I think it, um, it's not the best quality. Now, this is the last dress that I ordered. Can you believe it? But I ordered one, two, three different cardigans because I really need like sort of a summery cardigan. I tell you what, looking from here... I'm not wearing glasses, so I can't see very well, but actually gives me a nice silhouette from the front. From the front. Yeah, I don't know if I like. Anyway, let me try the cardigans. I'm just going to try it with this dress uh, just so we can see. Okay, cardigan number one. It's like a waterfall cardigan. It is sort of um, t-shirt material, if you can tell. It's everything is from I got from Next, but it's from Lipsy, Lipsy Curve, and it's um, yeah, it's twenty quid. I don't. It's a bit clingy. Yeah, I mean, no, I don't think. Bearing in mind, I am wearing it with the wrong dress, but. Um, this is a hell no. I absolutely hate the shiny buttons i think that's super tacky um i like mm, no i don't i don't it's just really again it doesn't look good with this dress but Okay, cardigan number three. I actually like this. Um, it is quite thick, even though it's open. It's quite thick and heavy. Um, I don't think it's it's not what I'm looking for. I'd be tempted to keep it, but bear in mind that I wear dresses every single day. I don't think it's a dress kind of cardigan. I don't know. And it feels quite hot. I wanted something light so so i'm not sure i like any of the dresses enough let me try on a couple that i already have and you guys let me know what you think okay this is dress number one this is probably my favorite summer dress because it's so light it's from next i think last year it's got pockets um right length i would definitely wear something underneath it like a slip um, and I would need a cardigan um, in the evening. I think I have. I don't know if I have a cardigan to go with it. But let me. So let me try this one. I think that's too casual. Not that this place is super fancy, but that's like. This is beach casual with this. I definitely don't like the second cardigan. I just think I'm going out for dinner in the evening and I'll be cold because it's still not super hot. Um, I think this is better. What do you guys think? But I think, I mm, don't know. Yeah, it's definitely better. Okay. 
Okay, so this is a dress that I own. It's a little bit tight here. Um, probably if I, I could stretch it. It is um, starting to show signs of being washed. You know when it starts discolouring a bit? I know it might not look like it. Um, it is a bit tight around here. So I don't know if I would feel the most comfortable in it. What do you guys think of this one? Hmm. Next. Okay, guys, next dress. Again, I've owned this since before I was pregnant. I'm sure I hold this on my channel. Um, I wore it whilst I was pregnant because it's got quite, quite a lot of room. But, um, yeah, it's... Um, it's completely see-through without a, not completely, but it's see-through without a, a thing underneath, which I would wear, which is fine. Um, the only thing is it gets quite tight around the boobs. So by the evening, it feels quite constrained here. I don't know. So this is the next possibility, something I already own. Last dress, you guys saw me wear this, I think a couple of vlogs back, some of you commented that you liked it. I've also had this one from the same time I had the previous one. Now this one is black and it's got like sort of white spots and this one is navy blue. I intend to wear this one for the Jubilee and then just add like some red jewellery or something. I think that would look quite cute. But what do you think to this one? Again, length just below. Also a next special, of course. Um, yeah, let me know what you think of this one as well. That is it, you guys. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I like any of the new dresses enough to buy it. And I don't want to buy something just the sake of it if you know what I mean let me know I would have put numbers all over the dresses so you can choose numbers and I'm actually posting this today today's Friday you're going to see this this afternoon let me know okay and this is where I'm going to end this video hope you guys have enjoyed it stay tuned for the next one and I'll see you soon bye